So, um, ladies and gentlemen, how you guys doing, man? It's your boy, Mr. J. Uh, thank you for tuning in and welcome back to yet another episode of Mr. J's Reactions, man. Hey, it's your boy, J, aka Kwame Boy. A bong boy, a de kule, a de wale, yo do kungwa ke kriyo boy, bazinga, manota, she, what you do, you dick gang, what you do, mother now, ladies and gentlemen, um, this disclaimer, this is a no musical reaction. I just wanted to talk about something real quick that just came to mind. And I had a conversation with a couple of uh, my brothers from Cameroon, and this, this this just came through. Let's talk about it. But before we get started, you know the drill, man. Hit that subscribe button, smash that like, and that notification. Give us a thumbs up, leave a comment, and please let the commercial play. You dig? So, come in. What it do? It's your boy, it's your brother, your big, your everything. We're going to keep it 100 on this shit. Somebody asked me, Mr. J, um, somebody not from Cameroon, a fan. Mr. J, how many rappers do you have in Cameroon? And and I replied, honestly, I don't know. Now, the question you should ask me is, how many top rappers do you have in Cameroon? And he was like, because I see a whole lot of names popping off. And, you know, they call them rappers. Now, Kamer, 237, promoters bloggers from Cameroon. Um, there's been this thing, man. I don't know if it's unethical or unprofessionalism. I already talked about this shit, about the, the home, the entertainment industry in Cameroon with these bloggers being, and they don't, it's like, they don't even know what they're doing per se, but I'm not going to attack you. I'm going to, let's clarify something that I've been meaning, you know, I've been, uh, yesterday, like, are we going to talk about this? Cameroonians, man, hey, 237, why is it that everybody that produces music, you guys refer to them as rappers? Why? That's, I mean, I mean I've, I've, I've tried to understand this stuff. I've tried to see if there's a, a logical explanation. I've tried so much. I've done researches. I've spoken to a few of you guys, man. I'm not going to put your name out here. You dig? I'm not that kind of brother like that. And I want to understand, is it that you guys do not even understand how to classify music genres? Is it that you don't even know when, who is where, you don't know how to position who, in what category of music? Or you just feel like you just want to, you just want to post something, you just want to write an article, you just want to WordPress something out, you just want to get paid that 10000 15000 25000 I don't even give a damn what you earn. But this is the thing, though. I will always try to help you guys professionalize the industry in Cameroon. And to professionalize the shit, we got to be professional in the kind of things that we write about our artists and the actors in the industry in Cameroon. Motherland. In Cameroon, some of you might not know, there are people that people call rappers that are not even doing rap. Now, just because they can sing in front of a mic, record a song, mix it, and put it out, people automatically call them rappers. They are not rappers. Not everybody who sings music in Cameroon is a rapper. I say that because I take rap. Rap is a culture. Rap is a movement that needs total respect you dig before you want to be called a rapper bro rap stands for rhyme and poetry you dig when we talk about rap when we talk about rap we talk about hip-hop when we talk about hip-hop we talk about balls we talk about metaphors we talk about punchlines we talk about similes we talk about humor we talk about a whole lot of these things now, I've listened to some of you artists called certain people, rappers, who really are not even supposed to be called rappers. I've read a whole lot. Don't come here and tell me about Mr. J. You thinking I, I don't think I know too much, but I know what rap is. I know when an artist's portfolio is rap. You dig? Now, if you take any artist who does any kind of music and you call them a rapper, bro, there is a problem. There is a huge problem. You dig? I would say, for example, there's this Cameroonian artist called Malux Lovibur. You guys call him a rapper. He is not a rapper. You dig? Malux is not a rapper. I've seen another situation where you guys call Fish a rapper. Fish is not a rapper. Fish does not do 90% of his, of his songs rapping. 
And we talk about rap rap. We talk about metaphors, bars, but these are the people now. No hate to this brother. It's all love. You guys don't take it. And your fan bases don't take it. Like, uh, like, like, is this an attack? Nah. Mr. J is just keeping it real. Let's both help this industry stand up. You dig? Like today, you guys still refer to Stallionas as a rapper. Stallionas is no more a rapper. He was a rapper. He's no longer a rapper. So we got to learn how to be able to say this. It's like, okay, everybody falls under athletes. Just because somebody plays with the ball, it doesn't mean he is a basketballer. Just because somebody plays with, 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 with you know, his sports is, has water in it, it doesn't mean he's a swimmer. We have kayaking. You dig? Yes, we have deep diving. You dig? We have cross, you know, mix marathon. So why is it that in Cameroon we think that just because somebody messes with music and he's a male and he can talk a few things in front of the mic, he qualifies as a rapper? No, no. I, I mean, I mean, let's, ladies and gentlemen, we gonna agree to disagree on certain things, but I'm gonna tell you this: not every male artist in Cameroon is a rapper. Stop it! And not every female artist in Cameroon is a rapper. Stop it! Learn to categorize these people correctly. Correctly. Don't make it seems like you guys are so ignorant, you guys are so uneducative, unethical, unprofessional that you really don't even understand what music is. You did? Have you guys ever heard Usher in America being called a rapper? Have you guys ever heard Bruno Mars being called a rapper? Have you ever heard of these things? Please talk to me. Have you ever heard T-Pain called a rapper? Have you ever heard Chris Brown in America being called a rapper? Have you guys ever heard of these things? Have you ever heard Two-Face in Nigeria being referred to as a rapper? Have you ever heard of these things? No. So why would we in Cameroon, like the bloggers, refer to artists that just because they do music as rappers? Please, let's put some respect to this rap craft. You dig? Hip-hop is not for everybody. Hip-hop is not for everybody. You dig? Hip-hop is not for everybody. I will look at today, artists of today. I genuinely going to tell you that the few rappers that I know, genuine rappers for today in the Cameroonian industry, I got Mike Munster. I got Chloe Gray. I'm talking about rap, rap. I got Chloe Gray. I got Joe V, of course. That's getting my mind. Joe V. You did. I'm talking about rap, rap. Rap, rap. I got Young Holiday. I got Blue Blueprint Hakim, my homie. I got Skeezy and Yankia. You dig? I can go on and on. But for you to come in and just put, uh, I got Tall City too. You dig? Big up to y'all, man. I just, we're going to talk about you guys. You guys, you go cipher later on. So when you put any artist just because they're standing in front of the microphone and do music as a rapper, it just, it just goes to stupefy the whole concept that you guys are trying to be respected professionally, but then you don't even know how to categorize an artist. So that's a problem right there. You dig? Fix your shit up, 237 bloggers and, you know, people who write shit. You dig? I'm going to keep putting this shit out. It's no hate. It's love. Educate yourself. Ignorance is when you think that you know everything and actually you don't even know anything. I don't know everything. You dig? But I do know what rap music is. I do know the portfolio of rappers. You dig? From the music to the way of living to the way of doing things. You can tell a rapper is a rapper. So stop calling any Jack and Jill a rapper. Respect that craft. You dig? Just like you should respect people who do Afro beat and people who do Afro Makosa. We need to start naming and categorizing these things correctly. You dig? I just had to say that. I just had to get that off my chest, man. No disrespect to all these artists that I've called your name. You dig? It's all love. Okay? Amaria, be good. Be nice, man. Give us a thumbs up. Leave a comment and please let that commercial play. You smell me? Peace. Action God, big up the RP family. Mr. J, I see you. I 
know some artists don't do this God 